Vad man kan redigera, man kan redigera. Okej. Okay. Då så den, den kan inte den är i bilden, den är i bilden. Okej, okay, okej. Okay. Okay, okay. Nej men så hoppa närmare, hoppa närmare. Så okej. Okay. Well, uh, vad ska vi heta? Vi Science of Gaming. Science. Science. <laughs> jag vill få in det där på något sätt att det är okay. man behöver inte vara en tönt för att spela spel. Man kan vara jävligt cool också. Okej. Okay. Hi and welcome to two cool guys playing games. Yeah, we like hip hop and we like games. That's pretty cool. Yeah. We just like don't give a shit. No, uh, I like Eminem. He's quite cool, and that's how I roll. So, well, hi everybody and welcome to this uh, unboxing of Through the Ages: A Story of Civilization by uh, Vlada. How do you pronounce this? Shavat. Yeah, he's some fucking European. I don't give a Yeah, I do actually give something, but uh, it's a highly anticipated game here for us cool guys playing games. Trademark R. Yes, and... Uh, uh, also worth mentioning, he also made Mage Knight. Yeah, Mage Knight, very good game, I've heard, never played it. Not uh, so cool though, it's, you know, it has this fantasy aspect, uh, that is for nerds. Yeah, okay. And are we nerds? We're not nerds. We're not nerds. That's something we really have to be clear about. You can make unboxing videos without being nerdy. Okay, with that said, I think you understand the premises. Uh, premises is... That's quite a hard word in English. Whatever the plural form of that yeah. is. So let's discuss the wrapping. Yeah, the this. wrapping. It's right here I can see one major flaw and that is it's a big hole right here. I don't think if you can see it, but let's see. I'll try to point yeah. out. Yeah, you can see yeah. here the reflection here you can see. Bit. The reflection is a bit off and yeah. it's not very nice, not very nice. So yeah. Uh, a small minus here for the plastic emblage on the whole thing. Definitely. It's also off here at Nikola Tesla, yes. His mustache yeah, here. His mustache. So, I don't know if we are to blame Eagle Games, Vlada himself, or just eBay. Uh, but... Uh, Here's my hand if you want to know what it looks like. There we yeah, go. there we go. There we go. Maybe we cut it, it out later. Maybe girls, we don't. I just want to say that. It has touched curls, yeah. Because, mm. like we said, we're not pussies. Bam. That's how you speak cool. Okay, so not lame, not lame. Let's go to the box. It's not as big as I thought. Just for Me comparison, neither. I'm really surprised. Yeah, really surprised. Just for comparison, here's a. Uh, well, let's say best Star Galactic. Yeah. It doesn't have that many components, but yeah. it's big. You see, it totally covers yeah. all the game. It's and taller. Yeah, we must say that Battlestar Galactica, not fantasy, science fiction, still cool. Yeah, yeah so since we're cool guys, we could also make the comparison. iPhone 6, iPhone, iPhone 5. 5. Yeah, you all know, you've seen this blue iPhone 5. It's not gay, it's just blue. And this more like, yeah, richie douche thing. That's me. Yeah, uh, and you can see here. It's a quite small game. I was expecting something much bigger. More like this. Yeah. yeah but we did not get that. Moving on. The, the artwork seems like fantastic we all heard about through the ages it's like some kind of civilization game a story of civilization you can read it here on the box and does it have anything to do with the Sid Meier civilization game or it does or not game? but I actually read online I that, actually, that yeah. uh, it was created as civilization the card game was the working name when it was produced oh, really? and actually when it was first presented in uh, i don't know in germany someplace mm -hmm. i think it was called civilization the card game but later on they changed it to through the ages a story of civilization so we can see what we're expecting yeah that should really have kept the card game part because then you wouldn't have that a big anticipation of the size of the box. Yeah, I mean, it's no. more reasonable for a card. Yeah, game. I actually didn't know it was such an emphasis on the cards in the game, which made me a bit ah. Uh, I'm not a very big so fan of for card you. games. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I'm more like moving pieces around, but still. yeah, you're like the typical non-lame euro gamer. Yeah, absolutely, absolutely. Mm. I hate lame gamers. That's something I need to say. Uh, we but also should talk some about uh, a bit about the cardboard because in our Terra Mystica unboxing, yeah, we also give that quite an amount of well comments. In the quality of the cardboard or no, the box well, it's yeah. kind of glossy surface. It's a glossy surface, which means I mean it's worth the money. You can see it right here. Definitely, it's a very high quality box. You don't get any stains when I touch it like that. I mean, no, and it's very nice. We can just see here the size. We just move around. Well, here it is. This is the size of it. 
let's get it back. But I want to discuss the art group some more because we can see okay. some really mm -hmm. interesting mm -hmm. things here. We see these leaders, Caesar, I can see, and this must be mute. And no, no that's Shakespeare. Shakespeare. I'm sorry, that's Shakespeare. <laughs> Who's this? James Conn? Could be. Could be. Or this is some fag with long hair. <laughs> I like him. Yeah. And here are our main guys. Yeah, that's a scientist. Yeah, because we're cool, but I we're think, still engineers. I think that's Newton. But that's not because I'm an artist. No, that's because he's a fag. Yeah. And it's okay to say that because, hey, we're feminists too. What up? Okay. We're everything that's good and cool. Yeah. But not lame. Absolutely. Uh, we can see a Taj Mahal. It's, uh, yeah, that's good span. I didn't actually see that. No, so you can see that only the box promised a lot of quality game time. A lot of very nice pictures, but whoa, what's happening when we turn it around? Very lots of pictures. Yeah, very, that's like my first impression as well. It's, is, is this the... Is this the game? Hmm? Okay, so if you take so much amount of time to producing a game that has good mechanics and everything, why do you do so bad drawings? This is like, hey, I, this is some kind of 14, 15 year old. It's extraordinary drawing. crappy, yeah. Very crappy, very crappy. A big it, minus right there. So I would say maybe that the game is really confident because this part, you only look at it. If you're, you're thinking at, about should I buy this game or not, what it's and about. And then you think no, yeah. when you, you see this side, I must say. So so that's why you know it's so good, so you know you're going to buy it before. Yeah. You even, they can even afford to have this lousy They can afford design to have lousy because people design. buy it anyway. People buy it anyway, and it's very popular, so let's get it on. Let's take the plastic off. Wow, this is quite quite something. You're starting there, not using the hole? No, 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 no. I can't use the hole, that's like cheating. Okay, sorry. Uh, sorry. No, 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 no. Well, I can comment. Well, it looks like we have a Viking on a horse here. That's good. That's I'm not good. sure that's 100% historically correct, but nevertheless, it could happen. I mean, it's, it, maybe it does tell us what to expect. If it's a civilization game, yeah. then it can have like, well, let's say, Taj Mahal in Mexico. Yeah, absolutely. It totally happens. And that's like the charm of civilization. So. I think this minor detail sets the theme quite good. It sets the pace of mm -hmm. the whole game. Definitely. So we can see here Tesla has some bit of a crappy mustache yeah. there. But let's get it on. Let's do this. Let this magic happen. Oh, it's a nice feeling, right? I can, yeah, I can tell it is. It's a nice feeling. Oh, it's a mm, box. That sounds it's a mm, it's box. definitely a tight box. And I'm going to take a sniff here. <sighs> Okay, it's a really subtle smell. That's quality. Yeah, I like I like the smell of new. So the first thing we see here are the rules. You can see here, we just flip them around. Yeah, you can uh, see how the many rules. pages. How many pages? Look Let's it. see. Well, we do like this for our audience. Yeah. One. Whoa! You can't whoa, like whoa, seven whoa, there. Whoa. We do not know that there are actually One, pages. One, two, pages. three, four, five. Six, seven. So yes. If you yes, if we stay here, it is really interesting. Uh, the part here. I actually feel a bit more now for the shows and design and color yeah. setting. It's actually really, it's really nice to go back. Yeah. I mean, this fits all together quite yeah. nicely. We can see it's a lot of text. It's a lot of text. Mm -hmm. We should say that uh, Vlada Shabtil is known for having like fucked up rule books. Uh, that is true. Very long, very arduous process to go through. He splits up the game in three different kinds of games, simple, uh, advanced and full game, and like have walkthroughs in every type of game. So yeah, but that's all. That's also the case with the Mage Knight, because yeah. so there you have this really weird sectioning of the rules, yeah. that makes it really cumbersome to find the part you're actually interested in. Uh, so what do we have? End rules. of the game, yeah? Okay. And 20 pages in total, this is the rule book. Let's see here. How's the um, quality of that one? Okay. The quality is, it's nice paper, it's not the cheap stuff you can find in Walmart, it's real quality stuff here. It doesn't leave any stains, it, this... You know, when you're uh, scientists, when you have this uh, gaming night and you drink some beer, eat some yeah. cool snacks, not those crappy snacks, um, snacks, it could leave stains, but on this one, it won't. It won't. Very good rule book. Okay, let's move on. What do we have more? Uh, play turn sheets look like this. It's Are these like identical them. or. I must do like this just so we can have more. 
yeah these are identical for quality cardboard paper here they are thin yet sturdy i really like that and it's a mm. lot of information these are a the... really nice touch really nice i wish touch. i could explain it to you but i, don't, I think it's beyond my vocabulary actually yeah. here are the playboards uh for different for different colors uh if you have to choose for different colors you choose purple gray green and gay orange sorry uh, this is a really really crappy green it's a really crappy green it, this it's might like be the worst worst kind of green i mean intense like lime green is even better neon green is better yeah these. but this and green is still the most okay color except for the gray which is boring but okay well the purple one is nice the you purple nice is again. very odd and i don't like it but okay. the, the taste differs and we can see here that clearly vlada is eastern european because the taste is so far i really hope the game is better than the design but let's uh, do it like this. Our viewers, if you use the hashtag sci the science of gaming and yeah. then your preferred color, we can make a poll of this and see yeah. which one is the most popular one. And we can all see which one is the most gay one. Is it gay purple or gay orange? Okay, it's up to you, but still nice quality I'd very nice orange. quality and we can see here a lot of information in these boards. Okay, so what do we have here? Uh, I actually don't know yet, but we have lab, a temple, farm. I think these are starting technologies, starting military, and we can see some, here some kind of warrior here. A lot of text as yeah, well. Yeah, a lot of text, a lot of blobs will go out here, a lot of pieces. So I like the uh, the feeling of what this is about to happen. So a good anticipation, very good anticipation. We can just check here more. This is one. Okay, so you have the starting things all over. Oh, the back yeah, side. Yeah, I was just about to mention I recognize this one, right? Whoa, whoa. You could have left it black because you won't see them as often, but no. Here you decide to put the design money on the back sides. It's a really nice touch as well. The material nice is touch. top yeah. notch. Definitely. Okay, so here we come to the big step. Ah, uh, this is the most important thing, the player board. Will the design still be crappy or will it be okay? Let's see. Yes. I would describe it in kind words as functional, maybe. Functional, maybe. You can see here that when we open it, it it doesn't lie flat. I see if you can see it here. Yeah, it doesn't lie flat on the surface as you would have mm, liked. Yeah. Uh, would have preferred it. Uh, these. It's a really good observation of you actually. Yeah. Of red text. Uh, Still, the designers didn't do their best job, but I feel like they first designed the functions that they needed, yeah, and had it through playtesting. But then they didn't get through actually giving it a proper design. No, they, this so, is just function. So I form. would actually like to see what they did with Game of Thrones with the game mechanics here. They do it with through the ages, but with the design, might that be an idea, Vlada? I don't know. It is. It, it is an idea. Is. And you can sell more copies because I would buy one so I didn't have to look at this crappy shit. Okay, but still, it should be a nice game. I don't say it's a bad game, I say it's a bad game. Not game design, but the game artwork. Okay. And it's important, right? It's important. You don't it's want important. to be seen playing an ugly game. No, if you pay a lot of money, you you want to still look cool. Okay, so moving on, what do we have? Wooden pieces. I love wooden pieces. You sure do. And here are lots of them, and they are really small. Like, actually smaller than they are in Eclipse. And they are pretty good at having small parts. Okay, so here we can see... So what colors do we have here? We have black, white, red, and yellow. I have no idea what they're for, but still, very small. They're al almost the same size as the Negroes in Puerto Rico, if you play that game. Or is that blue? It is... Uh, it's like one of those colors you don't really know. It could be you yeah. know, really dark purple. Really dark purple, which wouldn't surprise me. Why take the easy choice when you can go with really dark purple? That seems to be like... It's also a quality marker, you know. Yeah. You can discern these small features in it. Yeah. And here, more wooden markers. I love wooden pieces. Here, this is this is why you like certain games more than others, because I have wood pieces. 
Definitely. Definitely. Yeah. So I guess these are connected somehow to the players, the different factions. Yeah. And these are resources somehow. Resource workers, uh, reds, military markers. I do appreciate that they don't have that many small cardboard tiles or pieces yeah. that are actually consequent with just these uh, resources. Because yeah. sometimes they have just an abundance of different yeah, absolutely. Yeah, carbon and it, markers. Here we go with the cards. There are four different ages and they there are Four different cards. Of so, what are these ages called? I guess it's ancient, uh, ancient antiquity. Uh, yeah, that could be it. Does it start with uh, antiquity? Or I think ancient? it starts with antiquity. Okay, we can yeah. check the rule books. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, the ages are antiquity, middle ages, age of exploration. That's a new age. Mm -hmm. Uh, modern age. And that okay. means, well, the 20th century. To yeah, present, 20th yeah. century. An age of exploration is a fine way of saying colonization. Yeah. <laughs> Very nice touch to leave that out, Shekia. Definitely made by a uh, an European. Yeah, absolutely. But from the shitty parts of Europe. Must be said. Uh, okay, so... <laughs> you do not know that. I actually do know that. Where is he from? Czechia, Slovakia, but... That's uh, not a country, I know that. Uh, Czechia. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so let's open the card. Ooh, we can see the backsides here. Ah, uh, the, the same? No, not the same. Why does the Antiquity have a different one? I have no idea. Let's so open up and see. Phase, yeah. uh, 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 uh. No, here's the Antiquity. The A? Or? That's something else. Or? Okay, so here we just have a random card. And here are the Antiquity cards. Okay, so let's go through them. So you have all these sorts of cards here. So I guess yellow ones, what would that be? If we just take a sample. Uh, yellow ones. Build a new mine or farm, pay one less. These Let are some kinds of... Uh, these must be some kinds of upgrades. Mm -hmm. uh, we have different... You can buy them and you score. Uh, here we have uh, different leaders from the antiquity. Oh, that is interesting. So, so what mm. kind of people do we have here? What kind of people? We have Hammurabi. Do you know him? Muslim guy. No, I'm just <laughs> kidding. <laughs> Muslims weren't there and the antiquity, no. He's just an Asian guy. Yeah. That's true. true. Can't do it. Yeah. It looks like something. Julius Caesar. That's true. Really crappy beard. Yeah. Really Aryan. Alexander the Great. Very Aryan. The archetype of an Aryan. Aristotle. Very Aryan. No, not really. He's some kind of blend between like uh, philosopher and Aryan. And Moses, well, is he actually a real person? I don't know. You tell me. And then we have this guy from The Simpsons. Nah. nah. No, he's just from books. So he's mm. made up. He's quite fictional. And we see here they have wonders. We, we still hear, see, this is the part of the game that's actually very civilization because all of these you can get in civilization. Pyramids, hanging gardens, uh, Colossus and Library of Alexandria. My tip to you: Why did get this one if you play Civilization Five? It is the best wonder you can get. Why did they leave out the other uh, great wonders? Uh, I mean, there are supposed to be three more, right? Yeah, there's supposed to be three more. Uh, but Library of Alexandria is not one of the wonders from antiquity, and that is they true. Pretty Sorry. much erased the ones that you don't know of. These ones you all heard of, but the statue of Zeus. Yeah, and uh, uh, no, it's the lightning tower from Alexander. Well, yeah. yeah, lightning tower in Phalos. Uh, we also have. This is always a tricky. We have. Well, we all are just the hanging gardens. Yeah, right? and, and the uh, mausoleum so. Mausolus. Yeah. And we have the Temple of Artemis. That's true. I think you cut them all now because you also have the Zeus. Seth's Temple Mausoleum. Yeah, we have mm. them all. Very nice. We know our history. So this was antiquity. Let's see what's happening if we go further. We should take time. the corresponding cards, I think. These belong ah. to antiquity. These are a different kind of card. I'm not really sure what kind of cards, but they... No. And as we said before, the rule book. Okay, this is very hard unboxing stuff right here. Which is actually quite surprising since they include this perforated yellow line here in order to make the unboxing easier. Yeah, but, but in fact it's harder. It is in fact harder. Okay, here, I gotta hang on it. Okay. And then this so, guy actually has nails. I bite mine, you see here. So, yeah. 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 Uh, 
and here we have some kinds of event cards. Oh, so that's what that is. More on that later. I have no idea what it is actually. No, more of that now. <laughs> Dear, you got them all. No event. That's a bad card. Yeah. Right there. That's a bad card. Uh, what well, we have? H1. What was that? Middle Ages? Dark Ages? Middle Ages. Yeah, yeah. sure. Medieval times. What's happening? What kind of persons do we have from that part? Rich land. So these are quite boring right now. Whoa! Ah. A new kind of card. Orange card. Wow. Okay. What's happening here? We have two new kinds of... Uh, like, we all start with despotism. Now we have monarchy and theocracy. Are, are these connected to the colors in the game? Like, no, they're not. They're not. I mean, these it's are different. Uh... These are different type of governments. Okay, but I mean the color because there's green color as well, green persons, and there's a green uh, player color. Uh, no, yeah, okay. So they actually use the same colors on the cards as they do because we still see here. Shitty gray and shitty purple. Oh, that's quite decent purple. Yeah. But the green is better here. Much better. Yeah. And the green and the orange. And so the yeah. Guys have, yeah, quite correct. They use the same kinds of colors. And as far as famous persons go, here we have Genghis Khan. Oh, very nice. Frederick Bar Barossa. Wow. Christopher Columbus. Leonardo da Vinci. Michelangelo and Joan of Arc. Are there any non... Well, Genghis Khan, okay, well, he was in Europe, but the rest of these are all Europeans. And we have our first woman as well. We go... That is true, but I think she was burned at a stake at the age of like 16 or something. Yeah, and so. I actually think she's lesbian, so that doesn't really count. <laughs> so let's go to the card. <laughs> Number two, Rich Land. More of them. Wow, Republic comes here. Republic and Constitution Monarchy. We have the leaders there. Frederick will tell you more about them. Yeah. Oh, I say Mr. Cool. That's my thing. So, I'm Napoleon Bonaparte. William Shakespeare. More cool. Isaac Newton. Stuff. Maximilian cool. Robespierre. Navigation. James Cook. And G.S. Bach. I was first like, who is this? Because yeah. I was uh, not used to you know the uh, aberrated form of its name here. It's yeah. just Bach. No, 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 but G S Bach. Yeah, that's like, like, who's that? Who's that? Johann Sebastian Bach. Which is the point too. Yeah, because I know my second grade history. Bam. Wow. Okay. Things are getting intense here. We go. But we can take it because we're not lame. We're not lame. So this kind of style we just have. Let's go with it. Same cards, yeah. This is quite boring. You can take the leaders because here Thanks. we have some interesting leaders. But now we have Whoa, like... cool, 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 cool. Man with gun. But Very can we have cool. like national socialism or something cool here? No. We have actually fundamentalism. That's quite good. And we have Mahatma Gandhi. He got shot from Nikola Tesla. He has like parted up all his money, right? Mm -hmm. Alex Rudolph, a uh, Randolph, who's that? I have no idea. Winston Churchill, Nobel Prize winner, another Nobel Prize winner, Albert Einstein. Then a really, really unclear person that is kind of John Lennon looking, but the name is Rock and Roll Icon. I would say Bruce Springsteen with long hair. Yeah, or Mike Yeager. She, she kept the nose okay. and the lips. Yeah. yeah, maybe it's a fusion. It's they a must fusion. have thought about. Well, not Mike Yeager, but Bruce Springsteen and John Lennon. Internet. Really cool. That is cool. Okay, so that was all the cards. And, well, we have uh, three more. was well, like event cards uh, right here. And we just open up real quickly and then we're out. Okay, so here, first stage. Some kind of different colors. We have the brown, we have the purple, we have the green, we have the... Yeah, okay. Still a bit of green. It's more like olive green. So, but the feeling of the cards, the size of the cards, do we like that they are small? No, we will like big cards, but still, there are a lot of cards. So maybe it's just a 
but I kind of like these. They feel functional. Feel functional, okay? Yeah, yeah. Like that. Because if you send with a bunch of cards in front of you, maybe you don't need so big cards. Mm -hmm. So that was H1, and I think we will see pretty much the same in two and three as well. I'm gonna uh, show you the interior of the box here. The interior of the box. Can you see this? Yes, they're like separate uh, compartments. For each mm. kind of card is very clear how to very store clear. everything. Very nice. That's good. Yeah. Uh, so. Especially considering that they are not, that plastic bags are not included for the cards, so it yeah won't become a mess when you take these and go to no. you. Oh, oh, okay. Type of party maybe play some sieve. Yeah, maybe yeah. yeah. play some sieve. Maybe play, play some maybe do some drugs. I don't know. Yeah, because that's a pretty cool game. Okay, I, I think no, I don't care. You know you don't care because you're cool. I'm cool. We're cool and. We are out. We will clip as we fall. Now we will later in the Okay. Uh, don't forget to subscribe to our channel and check out our upcoming Eclipse A game summarization where we give you Mad Tactic. Yeah, because if there's something, there is something. We know it's all about tactics. Game out. Game out.